Bugs all over the world are disappearing. A new study says toxic pesticides are crumbling our ecosystem, leading to the decline of 41% of the world's insects. Tonight we're getting answers about what's happening in Davis to help reverse this trend. These bees on display at Sacramento's Farm Day are looking good, but there is cause for concern. The study in the journal Biological Conservation says widespread use of pesticides is one of the reasons insects are dying at such an alarming rate. All those pesticides coming in are really making them very sick and they're not able to survive. But it has a wax cover over it. More farmers and home gardeners are looking for natural solutions. Marone Bio Innovations in Davis is one of the companies developing natural products that kill pests. This is actually a place where we actually raise the bad bugs in order to figure out how to kill them. One target, the Ligus bug, the worst pest for California strawberries. If the farmers don't control this pest, you'll end up with deformed berries and the, nobody wants to eat the ugly things. Dr. Pam Marone's team travels the world to find natural ingredients for the company's products. This particular bacteria was found from a garden near a Buddhist temple in Japan. These vegetables on display at Sacramento's Farm Day are proof you don't need chemical pesticides to grow food. We don't use pesticides. We've been organic, certified organic since we started 35 years ago. Other farmers insist chemicals do work better and they'll keep using them. Do you like this? California's Food and Agriculture Secretary understands the argument but encourages farmers and home gardeners to go natural as much as possible. Sometimes it's unpreventable to knock down a pest population, but we clearly have many incentives and many reasons to use as many biological controls as we possibly can. The study says climate change is one of the other reasons so many insects are now dying.